Oof. Hey guys, Rusty here, Dougley HP. Today I'm working on a 05 Ford 500, and we are getting all of these codes for the throttle body. So if you get any throttle body codes on an electronic throttle body, 95% of the time it's just the throttle body. We're getting like nothing, very little. So, we're going to switch out the throttle body. We already checked the resistance on the pins. If you want to know what the resistance is, these are very simple. Four, let me turn this off so you can hear me. Four bolts, flip them out. Now y'all can listen to the dinging noise. So, pins one and two. Which are those two. You will unplug the connector. You can take the throttle body off to do this. Check pins one and two. You should have a resistance anywhere, from what it says, anywhere between one and 900. If you do not have that, or it's just, you know, reading like nothing, then there you go. Throttle body's crap, which these are most commonly 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 fail points toyotas nissans anything with these if any type of tps code idle air code or just throttle body code in general on an electronic throttle body most likely is going to be an electronic throttle body very rarely we'll go back to the pcm uh, Sometimes you might get a electronic pedal position error that could throw these off. And even on the more rare occasion, you might have a squirrel each crap up. But check us out on Facebook, hit the like button, subscribe, and as always, keep wrenching.